day for football we've got here. Martin Tyler here with you as usual, and I'm delighted to say I'm joined, as always, by Alan Smith. And it's the start of the season for both these teams. This should be a special game, Alan. Well, so much hope for both clubs before a ball has been kicked. Nobody's made a mistake yet, and as a player, you just want to get off to a good start. Hopefully a winning one. Enjoy the game. And it's the start of the game here. Saw the pass and dealt with it. The break is definitely on. Got to keep his nerve here. And a chance he hasn't been able to take. Well, it's one of the best opportunities of the match, that. And he should. He knows he should have done better. And here is China's team for this match. We've got it down as a 4-3-3. Yeah, it's a system that the Netherlands used to use all the time. I think, really, they invented it, and uh, plenty of countries have adopted it since. If it works, it's, it's really uh, tough to handle. Let's check on the Denmark lineup. Kasper Schmeichel starts in goal. Simon Kerr starts to put them in front. Tried to force it in from close range, but nowhere near the goal. Just needed to pass that one into the net. Disappointed with that touch. Well, they put the squeeze on and stopped the opposition playing out. Must take the lead here, which they do in good style. Yeah, they played some good football leading up to that, Martin, and thoroughly deserved that goal. Well, it looks simple, but this lad has got a great instinct of drifting into space, being in the right place at the right time. And that has opened the scoring. 1-0 here. It's a very good interception. Simon Kier. Matthias Jürgensen. Encouraging play from this team now. Keeping the ball. Martin Braithwaite. Scherner. Simon Kier. Paulson. Matthias Jürgensen. They can spread the play now. Scherner. Simon Kier. Larsen, Matthias Jürgensen, Simon Kier, Matthias Jürgensen, Braithwaite, Simon Kier, Larsen. It is a team that can really hurt you with the number of passes that they play. Simon Kier. Matthias Jürgensen. Delaney. Simon Kier. Matthias Jürgensen. Larsen. Still on the lookout for that chance to open up the opposition. Trying to find the opening, which would be so crucial. Matthias Jürgensen. Here's a chance to just stretch the opposition with a bit of width. Larsen. Simon Kier. Schoener. Matthias Jürgensen. He could cross it from here. Now it goes into the wider areas where they've got a winger waiting. Well, here they are, still probing away. Schoener. Matthias Jürgensen. Simon Kier. Larsen. 
Poulsen. Matis Jurgensen. Simon Kier. Poulsen. Trying to get behind the defenders to get in a good cross. Two minutes left, that's added time. Poulsen. And that's half-time. Signaled by the referee, 1-0 the half-time score. And here we go, the referee's blown his whistle. And we're off for the second half. Excellent challenge. Saw the direction of the pass. Dolberg. The pressure has told. And they've caved in, really. Well, we all knew what was coming. Certainly the opposition did, but they could do nothing to stop it happening out there. Well, he was on his toes. The defenders were on the heels. Good take. Restarting at 2-0. Predictable with the passing and the opposition able to deal with that. The visitors having lots of the ball. And it's been a really impressive performance, the way they've used the width of the pitch. They've swung some really good crosses in. The strikers have... Been... This could cost him. his responsibility it's definitely an own goal it is you'd like to try and defend him but he just didn't make up his mind quickly enough there and we restart the game 2-1 read the play well to intercept Larson, Delaney, Olsen, it's a quick break, just a goalkeeper the beat, he tried to blast it past him. Yeah, his composure at the vital moment lets him down there. An opportunity here, there's some space to work the ball into. Schoenner. Matthias Jurgensen. Paulson. Well, he took it on, Alan, didn't he, from a tight angle. Trying to catch the keeper unawares, I think. Matthias Jurgensen. Larsen. Simon Kier. Matthias Jurgensen. Plenty of space out wide, and they're going to use it. Simon Kier. Larsen. Matthias Jurgensen. Schoener. Dahlberg. Just read the intentions of the opposition there to make the interception. Simon Kier. And it played back to Schmeichel. So we're coming down now towards the last 15 minutes. Great team play, Alan. This isn't it. Everyone wants the ball. Yeah, and I think the movement off the ball gives the man in possession two or three options every time. What about that chance a few minutes ago? We can see it again now. How do you mean? Very impressive, the support for this team. If only the team could be quite so impressive themselves. Yeah, they're doing their bit, the supporters, they really are. So, just wonder whether he can transfer onto those players down on the pitch. It's going to be a substitution here for the home side. 
Seven minutes to go. Simon Kier. Delaney. Eriksson. Matthias Jürgensen. Dahlberg. That's how to tackle. Could be in trouble. Players do get lifted by supporters, by crowds, and this lot are doing their very best to urge their team on in search of this equaliser. Good show of character by the visitors. Last 15 really have got hold of the ball, and they have been the better side for me today, playing the more fluid football. They're just trying to put this match to bed now. Braithwaite. Matthias Jürgensen. Simon Kier. Schoenert. And it's come to an end now as the referee blows the whistle for the last time. First weekend of... Welcome to Mexico City. Welcome to the beautiful Azteca Stadium. I'm Martin Tyler. Alan Smith is alongside me. And it's the start of the season for both these teams. This should be a special game, Alan. Well, so much hope for both clubs before a ball has been kicked. Nobody's made a mistake yet, and as a player, you just want to get off to a good start. Hopefully a winning one. In this stadium, of course, memories of the 1986 World Cup, but it's also a venue in 1970 and had a most fantastic Semi-final, finished 4-3, Italy against West Germany. They called it the game of the century. Yeah, only got a uh, sketchy memory of that. I only ate at the time, but uh, yeah, one of those matches that have gone into football folklore. Now, this is the lineup for Mexico today. 4-3-3, and they've got natural wide players in that front three with a central striker. I think that's the key, because those lads on the flanks, it's quite a complicated job, actually, because they've got a come inside, support the centre forward, and they've also got to funnel back when they haven't got the ball, so an onus on them. Let's have a look at how the opposing team will line up today. Martin Hinteregger plays alongside Alexander Dragovic at the back, and today it's just the one striker in the side. They're looking good when they get the ball out wide, as they've done here. Pizarro. A couple of exceptional talents in a really good game that we might be focusing on. Well, two excellent attacking players we are treated to seeing. I'm really enjoying good seasons and I'm expecting a bit more of the same today. Baumgartlinger. They're looking good when they attack. Good width in the attack here, looking for a cross at the end of it. And the ball goes out for a goal kick. Oh, here we go, Mexican wave. Crowd trying to entertain themselves. Gallardo, Moreno. Now Rodriguez. Jimenez. Moreno. Gutierrez. Montes. Moreno. Gutierrez. Gutierrez, Jimenez. All oh, credit to him for taking that shot on, and he connected well enough. Well, he has got a strong shot, we know that, but not his best effort. He will be furious with himself for such a poor pass. Montes, Moreno. Here's uh, Pizarro. Pizarro. Oh, he's away from it. What a fine save. Corner. And here's a possibility of making a chance to go in front. Corner played into the middle. And defender can get it upfield. Now Rodriguez. Gutierrez. Ochoa. Well, he's got away from him. Hit it well! Well, from that distance, 
that was pretty close. Yeah, it looked like the keeper was worried for a second there. Stopping the pass getting through with a good piece of anticipation. Well, the hosts here taking advantage of home advantage with the possession last 15 and now pushing the opposition further and further back towards their own goal totally dominating the ball and creating chances surely they're going to get themselves ahead soon played down the wing keeping the wide attack going Pizarro Montes Moreno Pizarro Moreno, Gutierrez, Pizarro, Moreno, Eric Gutierrez. Well, the signal's gone up for two minutes. Montes, Gallardo, Moreno. And there is the half time whistle, nil nil at the break. So the referee's happy, the players are in position, the second half gets underway. It's a very good interception. Montes. Gallardo. Pizarro. Now, can they make this count? Keeping the ball well in a dangerous area now. Straightforward stop from an effort from a long, long way out. Well, he's been in the game, hasn't he? That's the best we can say for him. Um, but not everything he's tried has come off. Yeah, it was hard work for him in that first half. You could see him putting in the shift, but not much went right. And uh, he'll hope to improve in this second period. Gutierrez. Montes, here's uh, Pizarro, Gutierrez, Alvarez. Irving Lozano, Moreno. Moreno. Goalkeeper is there for him and he's played it to him. Pizarro. A dig didn't really dig deep enough to get the reward yeah over ambitious to say the least that one just booted forward under so much pressure credit for trying the shot Alan well I've seen him score from those kind of distances and that's what he had in mind obviously substitution coming up Conrad Lima. Now he's got the ball. What's he going to do with it? Moreno. Gutierrez. Moreno. Trying to stretch the opposition using the wider areas here. It's a pass, another pass. At the moment, just giving them possession and not much more than that. Well, he had a go from long range. Yeah, he just seemed to snatch at that. Got to do better. Well, they're going to start from the back, because it's a back pass to the keeper. Well, the pressure paying off, it's an aimless clearance. Moreno. Moreno. Montes. Eric Gutierrez. The hosts imposing their authority last 15 in terms of possession and uh, creating good chances in their search for the winner here. You can't say they wouldn't deserve it if they do find it. Good to see players shoot, but they need better shooting than that. Yeah, nothing wrong with the power. He got behind it. Montes, Moreno.
We've got ten minutes left on the clock. Oh, he's playing it back to the goalkeeper. And it is Lozano. Montes. Moreno. Moreno. Gutierrez. A titanic contest here. Five minutes to go and still goalless. Montes. Gutierrez. Montez. Oh, great response from these fans, really pushing their team on. They all expected to see them win this, and they might yet still do that. Jimenez. Montez. Well, that is the final whistle. It's all square. What a perfect day for football we've got here. I'm Martin Tyler, Alan Smith, I'm delighted to join me as usual on the gantry. And it's the start of the season for both these teams. Two proper teams here, Alan. Well, so much hope for both clubs before a ball has been kicked. Nobody's made a mistake yet, and as a player, you just want to get off to a good start. Hopefully a winning one. Check on the Belgium starting 11. Thibaut Courtois starts in goal. Toby Alderweireld starts with Jan Vertonghen as the centre backs. Kevin De Bruyne plays with Axel Witzel in the centre of the pitch. Eden Hazard starts up top with Romelu Lukaku. Axel Witzel. Toby Alderweireld. And it's steered back to the goalkeeper Courtois. Here's company. Jan Vertonghen, Romelu Lukaku, Vincent Kompany, now De Bruyne, Toby Alderweireld, Vincent Kompany, Jan Vertonghen. Alan, I'd love to get your take on this wonderful player, Aiden Hazard. Well, he's wonderful, isn't he? And he's at the top of his game at the moment. He's going to be a, a real handful today, I think. Toby Alderweireld, Jan Vertonghen, here's Mertens, here's Kompany, now De Bruyne, Vincent Kompany, now Kompany, Toby Alderweireld, here's Kompany, Jan Vertonghen, he's with De Bruyne, Likes to come into this area. They're wanting further up front, though, as the game develops, I'm sure. Mertens. Excellent play. Toby Alderweireld. Thomas Mernier. Vincent Kompany. Jan Vertonghen. Now Kompany. Vincent Kompany. I don't know what you thought, Alan, about Belgium. They look like candidates to win it. Did well. They're probably proud to come third, the highest finish they've ever had in a World Cup. And what about that comeback against Japan and Nasser Chatley racing as they broke the length of the field to get that late winner to knock out Japan? Yeah, it almost seemed like they had one hand on the trophy at that point. But uh, the golden generation we talk about so much... They are starting to gel now more as a team. That's our company. Jan Vertonghen. De Bruyne. His company. Toby Alderweireld. Axel Witzel. Here's Kevin De Bruyne. Jan Vertonghen. He's with De Bruyne. Toby Alderweireld. Axel Witzel. It's good attacking play this from them. Here's Kompany. 
the hosts have controlled possession here so far. But I've been a bit disappointed with the way they've gone about the business. Still time to step it up. But they need to step it up if they're going to win, because certainly not playing to their potential. Didn't really get what he wanted from the power. Well, he had other options as well. His teammates aren't happy. Oh, here comes the Mexican wave. The crowd having a good time. First touch was good, but he's got to work hard to keep the ball. Cuts it out nicely. Now, company. Vincent Company. Jan Vertonghen. Mertens. Toby Alderweirel. Now they can switch the play here. Jan Vertonghen. Axel Witzel. Here's Mertens. That's the referee's decision. Two added minutes. Really connected well, and disappointed to see that fly off target. Yeah, somebody in the crowd more in danger from that shot. Well, we're halfway through. So we're underway for the second half with Australia starting it on the ball. Interception here. Toby Alderweireld. Axel Witzel. Jan Vertonghen. Vincent Company. It's with De Bruyne. Maybe took his eye off the ball. It's a heavy touch. I see a substitute coming on. For the away team here. Hazard. Vincent Company. Here's Company. And here's Hazard in a deeper position, getting on the ball. Vincent Company. Axel Witzel. The build up is patient. Toby Alderweireld. Jan Vertonghen. Possession is the name of the game for this team with Mertens. Vincent Company. Axel Witzel. Working the opposition over a little bit here with their passing. Toby Alderweireld. Eden Hazard. They've lost the ball. Now De Bruyne. Poor attempt at a pass, really. Thibaut Courtois gets the ball from the back pass. Now Company. Vincent Company. Now De Bruyne. Jan Vertonghen. Here's Company. Aiden Hazard. Here's Kevin De Bruyne. All credit to him for taking that shot on, and he connected well enough. Well, he has got a strong shot, we know that, but not his best effort. Substitute coming on for Australia. Done well under pressure here to hold the ball as the challenge came in. Possession given away once more. Frustrating for these fans at times. They sense the game isn't yet up. Still chance for a winner. Just over a quarter of an hour left on my watch. Toby Alderweireld. Now company. And they're looking good when they get the ball out wide as they've done here. Vincent Company, Toby Alderweireld. Now Company, Jan Vertonghen. Vincent Company, Axel Witzel. 
His company. Toby Alderweireld. It's with De Bruyne. Hazard. A titanic contest here. Five minutes to go and still goalless. Toby Alderweireld. Maybe a bit of a sighter, but it was a strong effort. I have seen him score from those kind of distances. Just a mistake, really. He's not even asked too much of the opponent. It's just a mishit pass. It's a quick break. Two minutes of added time. That's what it says on the board. Toby Alderweireld. Well, they use the forward in these positions. Dropping deep, he lays it off, and they play from there. He's given it away. It's finished level here at the final.